Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, question is: A barrel of fountain pen cylindrical in shape is seven cm long and five mm in diameter. A full barrel of ink in the pen will be used up when writing three hundred ten words on an average. How many words will use up a bottle of ink containing one fifth of a liter? Answer: Correct to the nearest hundred words. So first, we will find the volume of the pen. So it is given the seven centimeter long. So you can write height equals to seven centimeter. So this seven centimeter you have to convert into millimeter. So seven centimeter means seven to ten. That will be seventy millimeter. Now diameter is given five millimeter. So radius will be five by two millimeter. So radius will be half of diameter, so five by two millimeter. So with this we find out the volume. So D F we write volume of the pen will be equals to pi r square h. So twenty two by seven into radius is five by two into five by two into height that is seventy. So seven tens are seventy. Two and twenty-two we cut, eleven here, and here five. So it becomes eleven into five into five into five. So eleven five is a fifty-five into five five is a twenty-five. So fifty-five into twenty-five. So we do it. So twenty-five into five that will be one twenty-five. Twelve carry. So again twenty-five into five one twenty-five plus twelve. So it becomes one three seven. So one three seven. Millimeter cube. So now this millimeter cube we need to convert into centimeter cube. So to convert into centimeter cube we will divide it by thousand. So one three seven five by thousand. That will be equals to one point three seven five centimeter cube. Now it will be easier for us. And the question is given. A full barrel of ink will be used in writing three hundred and ten words. And also in the last, it is told that we need to find out in liter, so one fifth of a liter. So we will frame it like this. So one centimeter cube. We know that a one centimeter cube is one ml. So one point three seven five centimeter cube will be equal to one point three seven five ml. Now. One ml equals to one by thousand liter. So therefore, one point three seven five ml will be equals to one point three seven five by thousand liter. So one point three seven five ml will be equals to one point three seven five by thousand ml. Sorry, thousand liter. So we keep it like this only. So as it will be easier to calculate. Now we will frame our sentence like this: In one point three seven five by thousand liter, we can write three hundred and ten words. Because this one point three seven five by thousand liter is the amount of ink in the pen. So we write with one point three seven five by thousand liter. Words written equals to three hundred and ten. So therefore, with one liter, words written will be equals to three hundred ten divided by one point three seven five by thousand. So three hundred ten multiplied by thousand by one point three seven five. So doing reciprocal. So now therefore. With one by five liters, so in the question is given the one fifth of a liter, so one by five liter words written will be equal to three hundred and ten into thousand by one point three seven five into one by five. So you cut five and thousand, it becomes two hundred here. So now you write it like this: three hundred ten into two hundred. By one point three seven five will be equal to say cut by five. 
so 200 divided by 5 becomes 40 and here it becomes 0 0.275 so again I cut by 5 here it becomes 8 and here it becomes 0 0.055 now this number we cut by this so by 5 only cut so it becomes 62 and it will become 0 0.011 so 62 into 82 so 62 into 8 becomes 496 so 496 So it becomes uh, 45090.9 something like this it will uh, continue so in the question I have told we need to find the nearest hundred so nearest hundred means we will write 45100 so as it is 90 here so you take it so this many words can be written with 1 by 5 liter so this is our final answer for this question so guys thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solutions like this.